So I have installed SQL Talk Plus <clears throat> on a virtual machine. And the first thing I'd like to show you is the uh, Connect dialog. If you open that, then you get a list of connections. This actually pulls a list from the installed .NET data providers on your machine, plus the um, configurations that are sa saved in the SQL Talk Plus configuration um, file. So you can add your custom connections in there that you can just um, choose from that drop down then here. So in this case, I'd like to connect to a Gupta SQL Base 12.0 server. So now this um, the screen of that machine that you see is hosted in uh, Waterloo, Canada, and I'm going to connect into a database server that's in Austin, Texas. And you can see that the uh, connection details are here in that um, connection string, which, um, you know, the passwords and um, IP addresses and everything, or server, server names. And I just, if it's configured right, then I just have to press connect to build the connections, and you see the system has connected using the SQL base 12.1.NET data provider. So here you, um, you have that new uh, ribbon interface where you can choose what to view. You can switch on the grid results. You have an errors pane there. You can have a list view of errors if you like, so it's easier for you to, to follow um, if there are problems when loading data, for example. Um, and you can um, um, work on data. So for the moment, let me open a quick script and just run the script here. And now I have, um, in view, I have set grid results to on, and I just execute this. And um, it's reading the data. And you see below here this um, status bar says it's active. So it takes a while because it's really pulling the data through half of North America, really, a few thousand kilometers. And here are the results. Now, in that new um, SQL Talk Plus, you can go ahead into a cell and type something in there, change it, and then go to the uh, data ribbon and say apply changes, and it um, saves it to the database. So you have a nice um, data edit or data maintenance tool at hand um, that works with multiple databases. And you see here the color-coded SQL that is in the input window. Let me choose, uh, change to the other one now here. Let's connect to a different database here, to a um, SQL Server 2014. And you see again the, um, the connection string is defined here the internal URL for that, or the internal machine name, and so on. I don't want to show you the password now. <laughs> and connect. Now this connects to the um, SQL Server on that machine. And I can go ahead and work with SQL Server. And let me open a script for SQL Server. And you see that um, the color-coded SQL here again. Um, by the way, you can also um, configure SQL Talk Plus, you can configure the uh, input fonts, output fonts, and it will remember all your settings, so you can adapt that to your to what um, visual layout you like. So in SQL Talk Plus, let's execute that query here, and which, which is basically give me the system tables of that SQL Server, and you see it pulls the data into the script. And if I change to the output, then you see the output that you would see in uh, the old SQL talk, really. And in grid results, you see um, the data. So these queries here, I can execute all of them. Basically, do the exact same thing. They show the SQL Server system tables, um, just in different SQL statements. And there's another table here, test data, that I can pull here. But let's um, do something more here. Now let's create that table here. Create the table, and you can always go to the Output tab and say, see the table has been created. And then um, ins insert that data. Insert two rows of data. And then you can select from that data. So 
a nice SQL testing and data maintenance tool that's intuitive to use and it's kind of the next step um, after SQL Talk allowing you to connect to multiple databases from different vendors or open source databases if you like. And with that, we are really at the end of our presentation and let's have a look at the available questions now. <clears throat> 